There once was a kingdom that stood imperious and grand, with a respected ruler who protected his land. With more glamour and purity than the sun's brightest ray, a princess peered out on that fateful day. A wandering summer breeze inhaled her fragrant smell and delivered the aroma to the beast from hell. Provoked and possessed, the demon left his cave. With bloodthirst, relentless to satisfy his crave. Observing the threat, her song became a shriek that echoed through the trees and followed a creek, until her cry met the ear of a valiant young knight who bravely drew his sword, prepared to fight. The noble swiftly arrived at the castle moat, where he first saw the dragon and its scaly coat. He arrived a moment too late as the beast sailed away, with the princess in hand, its delectable prey. Please, great writer in the sky, help my horse learn to fly, for the monster has taken Our Lady away, and I, a prisoner, am bound by the weight of this earthy ground. Fear not, courageous knight, I promote your righteous cause. I'll help you pursue the fight and extend your worldly laws. With newly acquired wings that pulsed through the air, the limits became boundless to the courageous pair. Silently edging closer to the mountainous nest of treasure, the beast was in view, inhaling the lady with pleasure. As it lowered its jaw, about to devour, the knight grabbed an emerald and hurled it with power. Soaring through the air, the jewel struck an eye, forcing the dragon back as the lady let out a cry. Dashing to her rescue, the knight caught her arm. They flew from the cave to escape malicious harm. Closely pursued by a geyser of flame, there was a deep volcanic rumble, and out the beast came. To end the onslaught, the fighter veered back raising his blade and charging an attack. The couple sealed their fate with a kiss, and the kingdom lived on in happiness.